What's going on everybody? It's eavesdrop and I hope that everyone in the eavesdrop army is having an awesome Awesome day now today what we're doing is we are trying out the cherry limeade G fuel phase sensors cherry limeade Gamma labs G fuel. I cannot wait to try it out Let's get into it. All right, now first things first, this is a brand new tub. So we do have to cut open the tub. This is probably one of the most exciting things about getting a new tub is just unwrapping it and taking off the, uh, the, the plastic wrap to get into the actual packaging, which reveals how shiny these labels actually are. Look at that. Look at that label. That's a fire label, bro. It just makes the tub look that much better. I know all I did was take some plastic off, but the plastic hides the beauty of the G Fuel tub. If you guys didn't see my unboxing of this as well as some other G Fuel products that I dropped yesterday, I will link it up in the eye and in the description. Definitely go check that video out. And if you guys are new, also make sure that you subscribe and turn on my notifications. It's all free, man. So you might as well do it. But with that being said, let's put this down. Let's grab our water. I am rocking the whiteout shaker with a red cap that I got off one of the many other shakers that I do have. So that's what our, our combo of shaker cup is here that we're rocking. Let's take the lid off of this. Let's pull off the protective seal. Woo! Let's get a gander inside the tub and let's take a smell test of the powder. It's actually a really weak scent. Now th that doesn't always mean a, a weak flavor. We've had strong scents with weak flavors. We'd have weak scents with strong flavors. So I, I don't think it really says much, but I, I don't really smell much. Uh, and also the powder is pretty much white, which means there's not gonna be many artificial flavors in there. So the water that I have is ice cold. I actually put ice cubes in there. You might not be able to see them because they have melted quite a bit. But every time I do one of these taste tests and I don't have ice in there, somebody in the comments says, bro, you've got to put ice cubes in there. So I did it this time man. I did it. I, I wasn't really able to get ice cubes at the dorm, but at the house, ice cubes are easily accessible. And in case you didn't know, one shaker is 16 ounces of water. If you fill it to the tippy top like this, it's a little bit more, but we're just going to say 16. All right. Now, luckily our scoop was on top, which is probably the most clutch thing in supplement history. If you've ever had like a protein supplement with a really big jar and you have to dig your whole entire hand in to the bottom of the jar or the bag, to get out the scoop. It's awful. But luckily this scoop was on the very top. Our next step is going to be to pop open the lid because you're not supposed to fill it all the way up to the top of this. You're supposed to fill it to the top of this, the, the scoop without the, the water bottle attachment. So let's grab ourselves one scoop. We will round it a little bit because like I said, we have a little bit over 16 ounces of water. So there is our scoop. Here's our water and let's dump it on in and see what color it is turns. I'm super excited. I, I, I'm pretty sure it's red. I actually have not watched anybody taste test this yet. So I have absolutely no idea if it's good, if it's bad. Some of you guys have commented that you really like it, but it's uh, it's turned a pinkish, pinkish purpley color. Let's see. I think what we need to do is we need to shake it up. So let's shake the heck out of this thing in three, two, one. Let's get it. To the left behind the head with the right arm with the left arm and give it a little bit of a swirl and boom there we go cherry lime ag fuel is a a dark a dark cherry color is is exactly how i would describe this it's not bright red like this cap it's a it, it, it's a dark cherry flavor i mean it kind of looks like phase berry but it's a little more uh purplish and I, I think it's a little bit darker in my opinion but without wasting too much more of your time let's pop the cap off of this and give it a quick smell test Smells pretty cherry -y. To, to me, I, I think I smell the lime a little teeny bit more, but we'll see what actually happens with the taste in three, two, one. Drop a like. Let's go. Oh, oh, bro. That is solid. That is solid, dude. That's freaking solid, dude. That is, this, this is a really good flavor. This is definitely probably in my top five G Fuel flavors. And some people always talk about the G Fuel not mixing up well. I don't think that's going to be a problem with this flavor. It seems to mix up pretty damn well, but I got I got to give this flavor. It's, it's got to get a 10 out of 10, dude. I, I can't see anything wrong with this flavor. I mean, if you like cherries and you like limes, like don't come into this not liking cherry limeade and then expecting to like cherry limeade. If you like cherry limeade, you're going to like the cherry limeade G Fuel. If you don't like normal cherry limeade, 
lemonade, you're not gonna like the cherry limeade G Fuel. It's as simple as that, but I will say I, I, I taste the cherries more than the limes, whereas I smelled the limes more than the cherries, if that makes sense. It's mostly, it's mostly a cherry flavor. If you're looking for a cherry flavor, uh, I would definitely recommend this. I don't think you're gonna taste too much lime. You can tell it's not straight up cherry, but it is heavily, heavily cherry. I'm gonna say it's a 70-30 split. 70% cherry and 30% lime. But you guys, that is gonna be the end of the video. That is going to do it for the cherry limeade taste test. If you guys did enjoy and you are new, make sure to click that subscribe button. It is free. Also make sure you turn on my notifications so you can see my videos as soon as they go live. Make sure to click one of the videos on the screen. Thank you again so much for watching. Have an awesome, awesome day. And as always, I have been eavesdrop and I'm out.